So for someone that, like me, I, I started playing uh, the division in the beginning for a very long time. Then I stopped for a while. Then I read about 1.8 update. I got super excited, started playing it. I felt at first like I didn't know where to go because I felt like there was so much content. And in a way, I was kind of lost. So when I started playing, I was like, oh, Underground. This is new to me. What, what is this? So for someone that's going to start playing uh, the Division 2, is it there going to be a way that easier for us to understand where to go, what type of content, what, you know? Because I, I felt like I was completely lost on the I, first one. I you know? love this question because, yes. to be honest, mm -hmm. I think this is one of the biggest plagues uh, with this type of game. And I, I'm talking about other games within Ubisoft where fundamentally you jump back in and there's so many options that you just... You're bewildered, right? Mm -hmm. So we're working on something, and this is the first time I ever talk about it because it's the first time somebody's asked me that question, which I think is awesome, by the way. It's a really smart game design focused uh, question. So that's fantastic. We're working on something called a progression tracker. And the progression tracker, it'll be in your main menu, maybe when you boot up the game, and it'll propose activities to you based on what the next major milestone for your progression is going to be. So constantly, it'll propose activities, things to try, things that it knows that you like to play to make sure that you keep on having something to play. Now, again, I don't think necessarily uh, that it's the only solution for that problem, but we'll keep working on it because I'm, I love that problem. I want to solve that problem for players.